I detest mobs. You're so good with Alvin. Know anything more about that magic communicator I gave you? It allows conversations over short distances. With some knowledge of magic, one can draw quite a bit of information from it. If the salamanders were using it to communicate with their base, I should be able to pinpoint its location. Short distances. Interesting. Can you check the last communication? The communicator sent a signal to a house in Vizima. It's marked on your map. Is there something I should know? I have a hunch. I'll check it out. All right, but be careful. I'll see you later. Triss has made me look at stupid pictures. She must have her reasons. Pictures are stupid! Finally! Hello again, Witcher. Greetings, Radovid. No magic mirror between us this time. I'm pleased you found my sanctuary. Triss Merigold lent a hand, am I right? You know Triss? Not personally, but I know Philippa Eilhart, and that's like knowing all sorceresses. I wish to speak with you, Witcher. Who are you? And I don't mean your name. Good question, but one with no simple answer. I was raised at the Redanian Royal Court. My father was murdered during the war with Nilfgaard. Ever since I lost interest in toys, I've strived to regain my heritage, find my father's murderers, and introduce order to my lands. Sadly, I'm surrounded by corrupt traitors, overly ambitious sorceresses, and frustrated chaplains of the Eternal Fire. From what I've seen, the upper crust in Temeria is the same. Nothing attracts sons of bitches like power. You wanted something? Familiar with these strange edicts in Vizima? I've heard about them. They bear the royal seal, but some suspect fraud. Tell me more. It's just as Tala said. Foltest didn't sign these. I'd recognize his signature. You know Tala? Certainly. I'd be a fool not to know Temeria's chief of intelligence. So Foltest didn't declare martial law? No. I feel I should inform him of this. Who is Philippa? One of Redania's most prominent citizens. She has bribed, dazzled, and bullied half of Redania's elite. She also belongs to the Lodge of Sorceresses, as does your Triss. They don't accept sorcerers? No. Each sorceress believes she's to decide the fate of the world. Sometimes they do. If you say so. Don't disregard sorceresses. Beautiful, wise, helpful. At least so they present themselves. Someday, I'll put them in their place. Though in her favor, Triss once betrayed her girlfriends. I trust Triss. Mark my words. What's your connection to Ada? I had hoped to persuade her to marry the King of Redania, which would benefit both kingdoms. With Foltest's help, our king could finally rid himself of all the parasites surrounding him. In turn, Redania could support Temeria in its fight against the Scoia'tael. 
I need not mention the benefits of increased trade. The kingdoms united could resist the expanding powers of the knightly orders and the guilds. Additionally... Enough. You've convinced me. But I'm not Ada. And you, Witcher, what do you think of Foltest's daughter? What do you want to know? You're an expert on monsters. You broke her Strigger spell. True. Hmm. Can she bear children? I don't see why not. Healthy human children? I believe so. One of the knowing could examine her. Thank you. Keep this conversation confidential, and please don't meddle in Redania's dynastic intentions. I generally don't meddle, so you have nothing to fear, Your Majesty. <laughs> when did you figure it out? Well, there's the way you spoke of Redania, of Ada, and then there's your ring. If ever in Redania, visit the royal court. Farewell. Farewell, King. Greetings. You've returned safely. The Hierophant revealed the cure for lycanthropy, but I must know your beloved's name. I'll not betray my man's identity. I'd rather he stay a werewolf. Carmen, I already know that Vincent's the werewolf. Please don't hurt him. I'll try to help him. Listen carefully. Yes? What's your real name? Hella, but that's too common. I spoke to the Hierophant about your man's affliction. Oh. Overnight, Vincent should wear a shirt woven from fool's parsley, and the spell will be lifted. That's what I'll do. I brought the parsley leaves. Weave a shirt for Vincent to lift the spell. Thank you. I'll start immediately. Downpour. Only my man is important now. Yes? Did the shirt cure Vincent? It was terrifying. The moon appeared, Vincent transformed, shredded the shirt, and ran off. Calm down, Carmen. Maybe another method will be more effective. Yes? Farewell. Oh my. Yes? Can you make a potion to cure lycanthropy? Hmm, never tried. The potion's for a werewolf, the beloved of a young woman. Usually I'd refuse, but I owe you. Let's see. Ingredients, check. Equipment, check. Come back later, okay?
Yes? Did you finish the lycanthropy potion? Yes, but she will administer it at her own risk once it drops in one of her tears. The potion needs a virgin's tear to work. Wait, you said nothing about a virgin. You said a young maiden. I assumed she wasn't yet married. Ah, uh, Caldstein. You need to get out more. Where will I find a virgin? A virgin's tear is vital. It can't be difficult to find one. May I help? Forgive me. I need a virgin's tear to cure a man's curse. A surprising proposition. I thought you could help. Helping others is my calling. And you found... the right person. I'll shed a tear for you. Thank you. You'll be fine. Yes? Here's a magic potion against lycanthropy. It should help. How will I repay you? Don't tell anyone I did this for free. I have my reputation. I'll give this potion to Vincent. <coughs> Only my man is important now. Yes? Did the potion work? Oh, Master Witcher. I made certain Vincent drank it, but nothing happened. We'll find another way. Yes? I've heard stories of true love changing beasts into men. But we make love regularly. Love means more than frolicking in bed. I know Vincent doesn't love me. Sometimes when he's angry, he calls me a vile whore. Carmen. I know I turn tricks. But for him, I'd agreed to be like other girls. Damn it. I'd even learned how to embroider. Listen, it's clear Vincent's lycanthropy isn't your biggest problem. Tell him you love him, and how you tried to cure him. If he's not a complete swine, he'll react. He's unsure. Torn between me and his work. He needs to set his priorities straight. Witcher, please talk to him. He's at the station. Uh. Greetings. Carmen asked me to see you. Witcher detective turns Witcher therapist. In brief, Carmen doesn't like you being a werewolf. What's your beef? It's not my choice. I can lift the curse, but you must desire it. You want to be with Carmen? Witcher... 
Will you give up your superhuman strength for love? Strength I use against evil. Strength that will one day consume you. You still have a choice. I'll think about it, Witcher. Love can move mountains, but... It must be true. Only my man is important now. Yes? I saw Vincent. Oh, Witcher. I don't know how to thank you. I'm awash in happiness. We had an honest conversation. I told him everything. How much I love him. Fine. He said if I cared so much, maybe this love deserves a chance. First time I ever saw him cry. Sometimes the simplest solutions are best. But that's not all. I haven't found hair in our bed recently. Maybe... Never mind, I don't want to jinx it. I have to believe that everything will be all right. That's good to hear. True love can work wonders. A real downpour. Mmm. -hmm. 